Hello everyone, Asma here, welcome to a new Elector TV video. In a previous video, Clemens explained how an operational amplifier works in detail. In today's video, I will present to you some of the commonly used op amp circuits and I will simulate their outputs using the powerful and affordable circuit simulator Tina Design Suite. Examples in this video are based on the circuit simulation with Tina Design Suite and Tina Cloud by Dr. Logan Ibrahim. The book is published by Elector and you can buy it on the Elector store both as a printed and ebook version. One of the most used op amp circuits are the voltage adder amplifiers, also called the summing amplifier, where the output voltage is equal to the sum of the input voltages. In practice, you can have as many inputs as you like. Our circuit consists of two voltage generators, each set to an amplitude of 50 mV. Two 9V batteries are used as the positive and negative power supplies. Simulating the output is simple. Click on Analyzes, then on Transient. Run the simulation and you should see the applied voltages and the output voltage as shown in here. As you can see, the output voltage amplitude is 100 mV, which is the sum of VG1 and VG2. And this is how a summing amplifier circuit works. Our second circuit example is a half-wave rectifier circuit. Two diodes D1 and D2 are used in the circuit. During the positive half cycle of the sinusoidal input, the output of the op amp will be negative, and therefore diode D1 will be forward by Z. The output voltage of the op amp will be about minus 0.65 volt, and because D2 will be reverse biased, the output voltage will be 0 volts. During the negative half cycle of sinusoidal input, the output of the op amp will be positive, and D1 and D2 will be reverse biased and forward biased respectively. Run the simulation by clicking on Analyzes and then on Transient. Separate the outputs and you should see the applied voltages and the output voltage as shown in here. Our last example is a voltage integrating amplifier. The voltage generator is set to generate square wave voltage with an amplitude of 10 mV. Run the simulation and you will see the applied and the output voltage. Well, thank you for staying till the end. Here are some other Elector TV videos that will help you learn electronics.